Hey everybody, it's me, Myra, at Down Home Money, a simple approach to financial freedom. So, you know, I've been doing this project and working on this house, and I promised you I would bring you all the details. So here we are today. This is our monthly update for May. I wanna show you what's going on. So come with me and I will show you. Anyway, we haven't done anything to the outside. We're working strictly on the inside now. And let's turn the camera around. Here we go. Come on in. Take a look. Sorry, there's no utilities on. We're going to get electrical as one of our projects to get that total all new electric. So we, I kept all the trim because it's pretty fabulous. And I love old homes and I love the features. So I've kept all the trim you'll notice around my windows. I am getting new windows. So that's coming. I've got to get a permit and get that all started. Uh, but I have ordered custom windows. So I've already had that ordered. And, um, you know, everything is so expensive right now. I'm finding while I'm redoing this property. But I did pay, um, let's see, it was uh, $1,800 to have the whole interior, uh, all of the sheetrock pulled off the walls and everything gutted. Today, you're getting to see the project um, all the, these walls, if you'll remember from the last video, and I'll put a link to it so you can go to it, but these were walls here, and now we have gutted those. And this is the other wall that I took out. And then this was the kitchen, and I've gutted all of it. We're gonna redo everything. So you can see we're preserving boards. There's gonna be the pantry. And then these beam, these, this, um, these boards you see here, they're gonna be removed. It's gonna be a totally open floor plan. We're gonna put some beams up there at the top. And notice the, sh uh, the shiplap. The whole house is shiplap. I'm still trying to decide what it is I wanna do, um, but I think I'm gonna go back with quarter inch instead of half inch sheetrock. That way I've kept all the trim and I can do the sheetrock. So I'm getting bids on that currently. Um, I'll take you on back here. Here we go, we're going back here. This is bedroom one, so all of the sheetrock has been removed. And if you like shiplap, look at this place. It is loaded with shiplap. And um, I've really been debating on what I wanna do. Like this closet has been painted, the shiplap's been painted. And I've had several people tell me I should just paint all the shiplap, but I don't think that's what I wanna do. I may do an accent wall, but if you'll comment down below, what do you think about shiplap? Should I paint it? Should I keep it? Should I sheetrock? I would love to know what you think I should do because your opinion matters. All right, so here's the bathroom. It's been totally gutted and we found a window that was behind the shower, but we are going to close that up and take that window out. And because we're gonna tile in a shower, of course you'll get, be able to watch all of that. And then here is the other bedroom, and sorry, we have no lights because we have no electric, because we're getting all new electric. Here is the other bedroom, again, shiplap, and again, the closet was painted. The shiplap was painted in the closet, so be sure and let me know what you think. And central heat and air, we're getting that put in also. It's all windy units currently, but I think it's gonna be look really great, you guys, because I've opened everything up, because look what I did. I got rid of those walls. If you remember from the last video, and I'll post it so you can go back to it, there were two walls here. And now it's gonna be a big open floor plan with a great kitchen in the back, with an, a big old island. It's gonna be fantastic. Then I think I'm gonna do some barn doors going into the bathroom and to the other bedrooms. Of course, this bedroom has an entrance right here and then you would go through this, and I think I'm gonna do a barn door here, and you go through here, and then I needed a place to put my washer and dryer, so I think I'm going to cut this out and do stackables back in there. It was $1,800 to gut the house. That was the cost to gut it. It cost me $450 for the dumpster, and the dumpster's just sitting there so we can use it. So just so I wanted to keep you uh, in tune what's going on. So we spent 17,000 on the foundation. And so the foundation's done, 17,000 for the foundation. Uh, I've got 450 in the dumpster. I've got so far 1,800 on the gut of the whole property and the clean out, which I thought was pretty reasonable. They wanted another 2,000 to, um, to, to take out the walls and to take out these walls behind me. 
and Rick Oliver can do anything. My husband is amazing, can do anything. So Rick removed both the walls for me and saved me $2,000. So thank you, Rick. Uh, free labor, I'll take it. So that's where we are. I'm, I'm just excited about it. I think it's gonna be so fun for you to watch this project. I did order windows. Windows were $6,400. I had to get custom windows. So um, I've got those on order and I had to pay half the money down and then half when they come and install them. So anyway, I'm excited. I just wanna share this journey. I am measuring today because I wanna order cabinets and figure out kind of the, the, um, the you know, how I wanna do the kitchen. So I'm working on that and uh, can't wait to share it with you. So don't forget to subscribe and give me a thumbs up and, um, and tell me, are you doing any projects like this? And what do you think I'm gonna spend? We'll have a contest and whoever wins, I'll give them something. Whoever gets the closest to what I spend and I'm sharing with it. So if you watch the videos, you'll know exactly what I spent. See you later. I'll, I'll uh, send you a free book, Down Home Money, A Simple Approach to Financial Freedom, if, um, if you win. So there you go. Just announced a contest. Pay attention. Watch the videos. Tell me how much you think I spent. So far, it's $17,000 on foundation, uh, $1,800 on the gut, $450 on the dumpster. I've already got $3,400 on the windows. And the windows are gonna be like 6,800, I think. No, the windows are 6,400 and I've already put down 3,200 on the windows. All right, guys, I'll see you later. Super happy about the project. See you soon, bye.